Well, I mean, the world wasn't ready for attitude in 2020. <laughs> but we were going through it. We, we needed some time to sit on it. It's true. Um, yeah. But that did quickly become a fan favorite. I mean, it, it's on Spotify yeah. alone, like 20 million streams. Uh, I know. What do you think it is about attitude that people are, are digging? It's crazy. I don't know. I don't know. I don't want to know. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> now, I think what happened also is when I did it, I was such in a good place. Uh, I was coming back from from uh, from Greece in summer, like having I was in the middle of my first love relationship. It was so fun. We were going up, and I had the day, this take seven Yamaha synth, and I didn't make music for two two weeks, and we we just parted in in you know in the roof of houses, uh, in in the Greek uh, you know village. It's it's nice listening to good music, good artists, partying in in you know summer vibes. Yeah, so I had all these visions in in in, in these summer parties. You know, it's like everybody's everybody's tan. Uh, you know, it's hot times, and I don't know. I just came back, and I think Reggie Snow. That I worked with also sent me uh, like a, a splice, a, a splice like a thing. I was like, "Oh, what is splice?" <laughs> so I subscribed, seven dollar a month, I think, and I just download random samples of drums. And I was like, just messing around with like drum samples, like I was like, Tum. I just make like you know, drawing the beat, take it, get it, I was like, mm, okay. And Deg 7. And at the time I was digging the Deg 7 a little bit, I was trying to get, you know, it's such a weird ass scene with algorithm going on. It's strange. I, I don't have anything. I don't have, you need tape sometimes to like save the sound. I don't, I can't save. So I was writing how to save things on the little carnet, <laughs> little uh, sketchbook. <laughs> and I was just messing around with algorithm. And I think I was, you know, I was just trying stuff. And I was like, oh, what is this, man? Am I making a dance track? It was stressing me out. I was freaked out, actually, by what I was doing. I was like, ah, scary. Like, he's, no, I shouldn't do this. It was taking over you. Yeah. And I just kept on doing the track. Da, da, da. Like, oh, maybe I could do a bridge. Round, nice chorus. And, uh, and at the beginning, the lead was not. He was actually. Oh, wow. And this looked like a song that I, that I produced for another artist called Vendredi sur Mer, a song called La Nuit. If you listen to this song, you will hear this riff. And my girlfriend at the time was like, "No, Luis, don't don't do this riff. Like, I know you made it for this other artist. Who you made it, but you you have problem. Like, you have problems." I was like, "Fuck! It's so I have to change the lead. <gasps> How can I change the lead? It's the hardest thing. Yeah, you know, because I thought I had the best lead. So I took a whole day. I was like, I sat down. Let let me find a new lead." Dun, 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 dun. And I was like, whoa, it's crazy. And then I j- and and then at the end of the song, the song is all done. And for the last, the very last drop, I wanted a big bass, and I and I just had, I just like I just purchased this. It was a very important purchase, very the, my mini moog. Like I was, I waited for it for a very long time. I, it was my dream, and then I f- just purchased it. And I was like, let me drop some bass with my mini moog, and I and I dropped the bass, and it was weird. It was like it's out of tune. What's going on? Is the synth is fucked? Fuck! I purchased uh, out of tune. Like, but it's supposed to be in tune. What's going on? Because you know you can tune it. You have like a, a frequency for the tuning. And I was like, oh, and I realized. The whole song was out of tune because the whole song was made with my deck seven. That was out of tune. <laughs> so the whole, so I had, I was like, no, I'm not gonna detune the whole song. I'm gonna yeah. detune my bass to make it work. And so, whenever I see sometimes people like cover attitude or stuff, you can't play on top of it because the song is out of tune. So you will sound out out of tune. And so sometimes I see them and I'm like, oh no. 
because the brain is like nee, 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 it's out of tune you, ha- you have to tune to attitude if you want to do stuff on it and actually for maybe one year the song existed with no attitude on it oh really it was called attitude but it was no attitude And one year after it was made, like literally one year after, the next summer, I was in, in Tanger with my friends in Morocco. And I was like, oh, I think I would need some people to say attitude on top of it. And I asked uh, my best friend, Taika, who's half American, she has this super cool way of speaking English. I was like, hey, can you send me a few attitudes? And I was like, attitudes. This attitudes, yeah, yeah, yeah. If you can just record this, and, and then her sister was there. I go, her name is Shanae. Maybe Shanae can can do it too. Say, so, yeah, you've got this attitude, okay? Yeah, yeah. perfect iPhone, okay? Thank you. And then you have the attitude track, and this was also very hard. It took me, it took me like months to like place the attitude at the right moment. Yeah, because you don't know. It's so cool. You don't know where to put it. Yeah, it's like an instrument in itself. Like, yeah. Yeah. If you put it too much, at, the, at the, the beginning he was starting, the song was like, it started with attitude, like attitude, this, attitude, this, dun, dun, dun. And everybody was like, no, it's like taking, it's like, oh, is it taking too much space on that? I don't know. Like, you're so into the process. And at some point I just found, after hard work, just found the thing. So this song is interesting because it's a mix of not knowing what you do, You just go freely and you're a bit scared, but this is the right feeling. You just go for what's presenting to you. And then you have to edit the shit out of of it to make sure it's perfect. Yeah. Uh, I mean, not perfect, but it's the right way, as you can imagine it is somehow. Uh, you have to work, you know. Yeah. There's no question. And then years later, it blows up and becomes a fan favorite. 